Hi, Dan Clark in beautiful Bay Indies. New listing here for you, proud to show you this one. It's a complete remodel, complete redo. Uh, new roof, new subfloors, new flooring, fresh paint inside and out, including the driveway, fresh landscaping out front, uh, everything throughout, new bathrooms. Uh, just excited to show you this home. Standing here, it's 415 Andros, didn't give you the address, 415 Andros towards the back of the park. It's the A Street, but it's the A Street that's in the back of the park. In fact, Curry Creek is just right here at the end of this street. Curry Pool is just around the corner here, so you're close to the pool, close to the creek, the kayak launch back there as well as the picnic gazebo back there. Nice area, uh, quieter back here. These streets are quieter back here. That's why I live in the back of the park myself. Again, complete remodel, standing here in an open floor plan. They knocked walls down. Uh, to make an open floor plan. So many people come, Dan, I want one of those open floor plan models. They didn't make those in the 70s. This is a 1979 Tropicare. It's 24 by 48. So you've got 1,152 square feet in the house itself, and then you've got another 200 square feet out front in the lanai uh, that we're going to show you here in just a minute. So again, flooring, Gene showing that beautiful flooring, the laminate all the way through this house, except to you get into your bathrooms. So there's tile in your bathroom. Uh, New ceilings up above, all textured, you've got can lights that didn't put in. Uh, they put in all new appliances, dishwasher, side-by-side -side stainless sink, new kitchen cabinets here as well, all the way through. We got cabinets underneath here as well, the drawers. Uh, just, just a nice, nice done job. You got this beautiful setup here. Again, open floor plan. They went with the grays. Uh, we've got a nice pantry off to the side here, double door pantry with triple shelves there, double shelves up above, so there's five shelves for a pantry built in. Again, brand new here. They did shiplap on this wall. That's something that a lot of people are doing now, the shiplap or the board and batten walls. It just makes the heist that much nicer looking, brings it up. All new light fixtures all the way through. I want to point out, the AC is up above, blowing ice cold right there, but again, it should, it's new. Uh, just much more efficient up there than when it's on the ground, uh, coming up from the floors. The only thing that they didn't do on this, and you know me, I point out stuff. I had a customer mad at me because I pointed something out that was wrong with the house the other day. Hey, we tell it like it is. They didn't do new windows, but I don't have new windows in my home either. Uh, coming from Maine up north, it's all the first thing I gotta do is put new windows in. And you don't have to put new windows in Florida, you don't lose AC out through there. I mean, the heat and different things. It's a different world here in Florida. Uh, if you break a window or something, hey, replace some windows. As I tell everybody, do the kitchens, floors, and bathrooms first. You don't get your return so much back on them unless you just want new windows. Simple as that. Open floor plan over here. Again, all new blinds. Get the two-inch full blinds all the way through in every window in this house. Lots of living area here. Your dining area is over there on the far corner, or you can have a dining area over here if you wanted, or that can be made up into an office. This can be your dining area. Lots of options, because you've got a great big space here for your kitchen living room area here. Um, let's go outside here and show you this nice front lanai too. Got a slider here. Um, the nice thing about this lanai, they mashed up the flooring out here. This is a concrete floor. Um, you still got the outside of the house that they painted. The outside of the house has been painted as well. They did put a new fan in here as well. I don't know if I got the switch on. I guess I don't have the switch on. You got an entry door over there with a little porch. Uh, Gene showing they put all new landscaping in here. This has all been painted up. You got a magnolia tree. She's actually just starting to blossom out there, the magnolia tree. Uh, all fresh mulch. You got flowers in here as well. Um, the nice thing about this, it's got the side to side sliders. So you can open this up, it's got the screens. I did see one screen that was torn in here, but that's an easy fix. I guess it's over there on that one. Again, pointing out the things that we see. So open this up, you're gonna get fresh flowing air in here. Uh, there, there is an AC unit here in the wall, but those are not allowed compliance wise in Bandies, that's probably gonna have to go. Um, but you could put either a fan out here, or you could do a mini split out here if you wanted to make this a, year, a little bit more of a year round lanai. But again, just opening this up, Gene and I can feel the fresh air blowing through already. So nice, you know, I'm gonna guess this is probably 10 by 20, you got approximately 200 more square feet, so it gives you over 1,350 square feet in this house. So let's go in and show you the bedrooms in the back. We've got two bedrooms, two baths. New fan here in this living room. 
Again, the walls and the paneling, but it's all been painted gray. As we come down the hall, the first door on the right is the guest bedroom. Again, same flooring throughout. It's a good sized guest bedroom. Got the little bit of a cornered edge out there because you get a little bit more room out there in the living room. Double closet there. We do have the fold blinds here as well and a brand new fan and lights here. So again, they've done new electrical, new light switches all the way through as well when they did the remodel. Does have a humidistat as well with a brand new AC. The guest bathroom has all been redone as well. We got tile on the floor. We got a new vanity top here, new mirror, all new fixtures, new medicine cabinet, new switches there. So you got four drawers and an underneath. And then I'll let Gene come in before I open up. You've got a linen closet here as well. Lots of storage space there. New tub, tile, again, new fixtures here. And, and the two inch fold blinds there as well. So brand new updated guest bathroom there for you. We come over here to the master. Nice light area. You've got the two windows here, plenty of room for a king size bed. We got double closets here. Those are good sized closets. Guess what? We got a third closet around there in there too. So lots of closet space here. Same flooring that goes throughout the home is here. New light here as well. Double windows, window on each side of the bed if you decide to put your headboard up on that end. Come around the corner, they put up the barn door here that goes into your bathroom. Uh, so that's slides just as easy coming around the corner to the master bath they completely redid this master bath again we got the same tile on the floor we got that same new cabinet here uh, all good there stand up tile shower there with the rock on the bottom that, that looks like it's rock but it's not it's leveled off but it's beautifully done got the shelves in there just got to buy yourself a shower curtain that's all again all new fixtures here bathroom vanity and again, we got an extra storage closet here. Uh, that left on the wall, you can see with the left on the wall, it looks like there's damage. They had to, when they put that shower in, they had to cut a panel in there. That's your shower access if you ever have to place anything on the shower. So that's why that's there. That would be in the closet with the door shut. So a decent size master bath. A lot of times these homes, this being a 24 40 it's got a little bit bigger master bath. Sometimes they're just small, but this one's good size because they reconfigured the whole thing. So very nice with the barn door there. Double closets with the third closet in the master. Nice updated guest bath. Like I said, this home's completely remodeled, redone. Again, floors, roof, AC. Uh, you got to buy a little bit of furniture. What you see does come with the home. But uh, a couple bedroom sets, if you want to change something up here or whatever you want to do, flavor it your way is what I always say. Beautiful home back here on Andros, back of the park, nice location, nice lot, long carport out there that could be screened in as well. Plenty of parking for two or three cars. Does have the storage shed there in the back. The washer and dryer is in the storage shed, uh, along with an extra refrigerator. Got the beer fridge, water fridge, extra freezer out there as well. They've got a lot of their tools stored out there, so I'm not showing you pictures of the shed, but come see the home, it's there, everything's good to go. Dan Clark, My Florida Dreams. If you're looking for a home that you can put your suitcase down, flip-flops on, head to the beach of the pool, this one's for you. You like the open floor plans updated, buy a little furniture, which is easy to do down here, and you're good to go. You're living in paradise like the rest of us. Dan Clark, My Florida Dreams. Give me a call, 207-807-7537.